guys, KSK here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Android Pie, GSI, and Poco F1. So let's get started. Alright guys, so before uh, doing anything, so I recommend you to make a complete backup of your device. The following process of installing Android Pie, GSI and Poco F1 will completely wipe user data. So just go ahead and back up all of your user data. So once everything is done, so just go to the settings. And inside the settings, you can find the about phone and then tap on the MIUI version for a couple of times in order to activate the developer options. Then you go back to the main page of the settings and then scroll all the way until you see the option called additional settings. Now inside the additional settings, you can encounter the developer options here. Just go ahead and select it and make sure your device has an unlocked bootloader. So just in case, if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader of Poco F1, I already made a dedicated video for this on this channel. So if you want, find the link in the description or you can see somewhere the card flowing over there on the screen. So anyway, back to the phone here once it's done so just go back to the me account if you have signed in inside the me account just go ahead and sign out from it and now you're good to go so now back to the a computer on your pc check the links in the description down below and you need to download all of these files so this is the a pixel experience based android p um gsi for poco f1 and you need to download platform tools and disable force encryption so just go ahead and extract the a pixel experience uh, zip files so inside that you're gonna find the .img files which is the one we need to flash it using the TWRP recovery so for this uh, video I will be using a USB OTG so I recommend you to copy the a disable force encryption file as well as a pixel experience file onto your SD card so do not copy it to the internal storage just go ahead and use the internal uh, I mean SD card for the sake of your convenience just go ahead and uh, copy it onto your uh, SD card so as you can see that I'm copying into my USB OTG so once it's done copying these two files then go back to the uh, main page of all of these files which is where you're having in your computer now you need to extract the uh, platform tools the platform tools basically contains the ADB and fastboot commands which allows you to install the TWRP recovery on your Poco F1. Just go ahead and extract it. Once you're done extracting it, inside this, you're gonna find the new folder. So as you can see that we have the ADB as well as the fastboot commands. And then you go back to the here and then uh, move this TWRP image file into this uh, platform tools. Now once it's done, so on the address bar here, just go ahead and highlight this address and then just type the CMD and press the return key on your computer. So this is going to instantiate the a command prompt on the current working directory, so which is where all the files are located. So you can see that we need to flash this TWRP image file. So back to the camera view, so you need to go ahead and turn off your phone, make sure your phone has a sufficient battery, then go ahead and put the phone into the fast boot mode by holding the power as well as the volume down for a couple of minutes. When you see this fast boot logo, just go ahead and grab up the USB cable and connect it to your device. Now on the computer, so first thing first, and you need to type this command called fast boot devices to make sure the device is still intact with the computer. Once you can see that uh, reference ID here, then type this command called Facebook flash recovery and then TWRP and then press the tab key to autocomplete and then press the return key. This is going to flash the TWRP recovery onto the Poco F1. Then type this command called Facebook boot and TWRP.img and then press the return key. So this is going to boot into the TWRP. So once your device inside the TWRP recovery, so as you can see that I have to use a USB OTG which is where all of the files are located in. Just go ahead and hook it up. Now if you see this message for the first time, just go ahead and cancel this to decrypt the data. Then swipe to all of the modifications. The first thing you need to do is select the wipe and then select the format data. Here you need to type yes uh, to remove the encryption of the current ROM. Once it's done, now go back to the a home screen of the TWRP recovery, select the reboot and then reboot back to the recovery. Now once you're back inside the TWRP, just go ahead and select the amount and then make sure that you have uh, selected these two options, system as well as the vendor. Then go back to the main page of the settings, select the install and choose this uh, storage which is where the files that you copied and then select the a disable force encryption uh, zip file.
Alright, so once it's done uh, flashing this zip file, so now go ahead and select the backup and make sure that you backup the uh, current MIUI ROM either into the SD card or the USB OTG. Do not, do not ever backup onto your internal storage. Just go ahead and copy it and move that backup somewhere on your computer. Once the backup is done, now last but not the least, just go ahead and select the install button. So once you select the install button, you're going to see change the mode from zip mode to the install image mode. Just select that image mode and then you're going to see the uh, pixel experience.img file. Select that and choose a system image and flash it as system, system image by swiping to confirm flash. And that's it. And it should going to take a couple of minutes and don't do anything. And once it's done, just go back to the home screen, select the wipe and then swipe to factory reset. And now you can reboot the system and your device should boot into the uh, Android Pie GSI uh, very very easily so and you can see that the Google logo over there and that's it and this is how you can uh, install the Android Pie GSI on Poco F1 if you see any kind of the uh, popping warnings just go back to the recovery and wipe the data and you will no longer gonna see that or you can go to the play store and update the google application which will fix any kind of errors i already made a dedicated video on this gsi rom of poco f1 if you want to watch the video just find the link in the description or you can see somewhere the card over there on the screen so anyway at any point if you have uh, decided to go back to the a uh, me ui just go ahead turn off the phone and then put the phone into the recovery by holding the power as well as the volume up and then your device is going to be put into the TWRP recovery and simply uh, select the uh, restore button here and then you need to uh, choose a storage select your backup and swipe to restore and that's it and this is going to be take you back to the MIUI 9 or MIUI 10 whatever the ROM that you're using on your phone and that's pretty much it and this is how you can uh, install Android Pie GSI on Poco F1. So if you like this video give a thumbs up and if you don't just go ahead and dislike this video and su subscribe to this channel for more future videos like this. Anyway this is KSK here signing off. Peace out.